Okay, hi guys, my name is Miranda and welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel, subscribe, click it, you can do it while you're watching. And in all my videos, I keep saying and I keep talking about my hair and how annoying it is because it is growing in and it's in its process of growing in and the sides are absolutely insane because I have very 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 curly hair and it's insanely curly and it's very annoying and he wouldn't know that because I straighten it and I don't like my hair curly so I'm going to take you through the process of why I cut my hair and when I did and why I'm letting it grow in now so I was about 13 no, it was probably 12. I was probably like 12 and my hair was like, it was like down to here. And I guess I was just like, I don't know if it was just laziness or I just didn't really care too much at the time to do it. I didn't like the way it looked. It was just very boring I guess it was just always pulled up and it just I didn't like the way it looked and I am a huge pink fan a very very big pink fan I have her song lyrics tattooed down my sleeve if anyone has ever picked that up I said I will do a tattoo tour when my sleeve is done but that's for another video um, but she is one of my favorite singers and I was looking all over the place on where to cut my hair and all of a whole bunch of different pictures and I couldn't find a picture that I liked, I couldn't find a hairstyle that I liked, I just couldn't figure it out. And it was taking me weeks and weeks and weeks and finally I was just like, I'm just going to cut it off, I can't figure it out. And then she posted this picture of herself in a helicopter with heart sunglasses on and if I could find the picture I'm gonna put it in I think she had like heart sunglasses on and the sides of her head are shaved like literally shaved and just hair like spiked hair on the top and I remember I saw this picture and I was like oh my god that's what I want my hair to look like and then it was like, now I have to ask my mom if I can cut my hair like this. And being 13, 12, 13 years old, that's always an iffy subject being a girl in sixth grade. You know, it's, your parents always want what's best for you and being bullied and everything. But if anyone watched my coming out video and see my mom she's like the most amazing person ever so she had absolutely no problem with it she just looked at me and said is that what you really want really think about this and know that your hair takes a while to grow back and really think about it and I was really determined I was like this is what I want let's do it okay and I think the next day I went to the hair salon and I just cut all of my hair off and I remember being like 13 and it being like the best feeling in the entire world I was just like oh my god this is great like I finally felt like so free like I did not like my long hair and it was not a mistake it definitely wasn't I loved my short hair so from like from like th 13 to about a year ago I really liked my short hair and I'll put in a whole bunch of pictures of like the hairstyles I did I'll try and put in a whole bunch of like how it looked and the different colors that I had it because I think I've had every color of the rainbow in my hair I've had purple I've had blue I've had green I have had it bleach blonde, I've had it white, I have had it pink, I have had it literally I think almost every color. So when I started to come to terms with who I was 
and knowing that who I really am. It felt so good to be free and be able to be able to be who I really was. After the freedom of being out, my next step was the freedom of my appearance and how I how confident I wanted to feel in that. So it was my clothes and what I wanted to wear. And it was a lot of t-shirts and jeans and it was no longer really tight tank tops and dresses and those things that I wanted to wear. I mean, I still wear, I still will wear a dress if I have to and stuff like that, but it's not my outfit of choice. But now it's what I wanted to wear and I decided that I wanted to grow my hair and I want my long hair again. And that is such the great thing with hair is that you can literally do whatever you want with it. You can dye it any color, you can dye it back, you can cut it all off and it grows back, you can let it grow, you can do whatever you want. But the thing that sucks is when your hair is so short, it takes a while to grow back in. So I am at about a year of this growing in and my hair is probably like about here. So this is about a year of it growing in. I mean, I feel like it's grown very quick. But the sides of my head, which were completely shaved, and my hair being extremely curly in the way that it is, that has been the really big struggle. So for everyone who keeps asking why I wear hats in a lot of my videos, or I keep playing with my hair and doing this, or if I get really close to the camera and I try and like do one of those and I actually make fun of it, it is because I am trying to let my hair grow out. So that is the quick rundown with my hair. And literally just becoming who I am. And it is a really, really good feeling with after, after I came out, with, I can be who I am with my appearance wise, I can now do what I want. And that was a really good feeling. But on another note, I know a lot of you guys like my vlogs for some reason. My vlogs get a lot more views and a lot more likes. So, with that being said, I have a couple things coming up. And I want to know, do you want me to vlog it? Like, I'm going to a pink concert in two weeks. And I have pit seats, and if anyone knows Pink's performances, they're amazing. So I have really good seats, and I can vlog going, and I feel like that would be a really fun video. If anyone wants to see that, let me know. But subscribe, like, hit the bell so you don't miss another video. See you next week. Bye. Why do I look so pale?